door door's open. Nee, nee. Fijn man. Ik heb I'm not gonna ask it. So we are here at Salvo de Buga. Hope I pronounced that right. This is track number four out of uh, five. We are, I think, seven days into the trip and it is absolute carnage. So in this video, you're gonna have this track day, the previous track day, and all of the mental street stuff in between because everything that we've done so far has just been absolute fucking carnage. So yeah, enjoy, see you in the next one. We've made it to, is this the third track? Third track, which is Driftland, Portugal. And it's raining. Yeah, we came to Portugal and it's fucking raining. It looks like an ice rink right now because there's a load of rubber down and it's pissing over rain. It'll be a wicked track for the 350Zs for tandems. Not sure about the 15, I don't think it'll enjoy it here very much. But we'll go out and have a few laps, just, yeah, not my kind of driving in the rain, to be honest. Seems pretty cool, cool place. Seems like a cool place for like a load of mates to come and hang out. So yeah, we're gonna um, go out there and have a look and see how we get on. Hi guys, this is our special friend Ellis. <laughs> this is Ellis with the... Uh... So, <laughs> <laughs> so ironically, this is the grippy part. Yeah. This is the grippy part? This is the gr oh, just you wait. Just you fucking wait. The grippy bit though, remember? Who can do the longest slide? Oh, wait. Thank you, you boy. <laughs> what about in those bomb holes? What about that bit? This is bomb holes. Those bomb holes. <laughs> those bomb holes. <laughs> no, no, I swear to God, this is the fresh tarmac. This is, <laughs> this is right. Someone is crashing yeah. into that wall. Probably yeah. be quite fun in the drive. I just wish it wasn't raining. <laughs> oh, that has nothing. It's the next bit after. Oh, then you get a bit of grip there. Yeah. So it pulls your front round. <laughs> just as it pulls your front round, you hit no grip. no <laughs> chance. <laughs> Here we go. And then... Oh my god! <laughs> so we're going out for a first lap. It's very wet, so we're just gonna go out, chill, and see how we get on. Done a couple of laps and it is like ice skating. Yeah, proper like ice skating. So let's get it the other drive. Hopefully it dries out. When it dries out, I'll go back out for some more. Because at the moment, in that, oh, I ain't really interested in that. It's so slow, it's just a bit meh.
Right, we're going to go up some more laps. It's drying out a little bit, but it's still patchy. So like the main corner looks like it's dry, but the back is still like an ice rink. But I'm bored of standing around, so I'm just going to go out for a couple of laps. We can't wait to see Jake Skinner today. Yeah, so We're excited. excited. Like, all my, fan, all my fans are buzzing. JC! <laughs> all, the, uh, all my cheerleaders are going to be waiting on the side. Going, <laughs> bare arse as well. I think I broke a drive shaft. <laughs> I just dropped the clutch in a second as I transitioned and it just went bang, no drive. So I reckon it snapped the outer stub. Yeah, that's what I usually that's what I usually break. I reckon it snapped the outer stub into the hub. Oh, fuck oh, This side still spinning. Monster Energy fucking coin on my shit. That's it, we're we've made it now. Sponsored now, that's it. Everyone, Monster, I've made it. <laughs> Yourself. That is quite low as well. That's grim. I felt it come out. That's fucking. I thought, as it come out, I thought that's going to be a fucking beast. That is actually a. That's a, that's a family killer. That one. That would finish. That would finish families that made it out of Chernobyl. I've done the sports. Did a snapper. But well, that's all right because now, on the long side. I've now got one shaft for my foot inside and one shaft for my foot the outside, so now I can just make a good one out of two. And then it should be brand new. Um, we've just replaced shaft. Uh, I just snapped the outer stub axle, and luckily I've got uh, I've got one shaft that's got a good stub axle and a bad inner. And now I've got a shaft that's got a good inner and a bad outer, so I'm just going to swap the two and make another good one. But yeah, we're fixed for now. We can get back out. day here didn't actually dry very much I think I got about four laps in the dry and then two in the wet I went back out to do a lap in the dry and broke shaft so I had to replace that but wicked day car did everything it needed to do I managed I got to be the last guy of the day which is always fun so I went out and did a big old smoky one up the wall uh, but on the second run my IETs were so high I got to the end of the run it was pulling so much timing it was like driving a 200 horsepower car but anyway it's good fun so yeah, we've had a wicked time here at Griffland, Portugal, and now we're gonna head back to the hotel, grab some dinner. See you in a bit.
Oh, uh, you said you weren't filming. Yeah, we're filming now. Good morning. What's going on? Uh, we're changing a wheel bearing at some point, tightening up all the other ones that have worked loose, and causing carnage in the process. So check all these measures. These are shaft measurements, yeah? So the internal, internal dimensions of this bit, yeah? Yeah. That's in inches, so he gave me in mils. So it's 36, 98 or 99. 26.98. Should be around 30 ish. Now you need a sleeve size. So that's just a. Uh, You're telling me that's no experience. Don't bully me into the vodka, you're not bullying me into the game. No. Ellis, drink it. It's only one. Can I shag him? I guess you have to take it. I don't know fucking build that man, I'd rather won't be dad. This cunt, fucking media nerds, always incriminating bastards. Get that from fucking. another day in the chaos of the Up in Smoke tour. We've been joined by our good friend Shafen and Gabriel. We're late as always. Late as always. Nobody told us this is going on down here. <laughs> uh, so today today we've got a drift event later on today but we've got quite a few hours of chill time between now and then. So we're going to jump in the trucks and cars, run up to the track, drop off the trailers and then I think we're going to, I don't know, go and explore Portugal, try and find some crazy roads up in the mountains and do some stupid shit. So we've made it to the track, up the top of a mountain, it's pretty cool. It's pretty savage around here, because it's where they've had all the forest fires a few days ago. And you're driving down the road and literally everything is just burnt to a crisp. Literally everything. It's quite sad really, there's a lot of people's like houses that burn and all that sort of stuff, so. Yeah, a little bit mad. Shout. I think it's the right entrance. So I actually get these clips of uh, all the cars coming in. Uh, they all get to drive, and I'm the cunt that has to walk the whole way back down the bottom. Did he give you a wristband? I'm gonna become a fucking vlogger, mate. Did he give you a wristband? Nah. Well, you ain't a fucking VIP, Ooh, bro. Fucking hell. That was a bit sporty, that is. You might need a hydrant. 100%, I've got to do these big fucking reverse entries. <laughs> Really? Well, I've got a door chauffeur and I don't know Bang! <laughs> we are here at Servo de Buga. This track is wicked, so you get like a really nice entry down the hill. You can lock into the first corner. You can go all the way around the first corner, full lock, full throttle. It's like a jump as you transition. Yeah, really sick.
that done. I'm a fan. That's a sick track. I was I was pretty held back to try and like make sure I made the points and didn't fucking overdo it or make myself look like a dick. But yeah, that's a fucking cool track. That would actually be sick for tandems as well. So yeah, I'm buzzing. <laughs> Literally, we're in the middle of a, an old forest fire, just burnt trees. There's even like, if you look over here, this is still smoking. This bit down here is still smoking. It's just ash. You can see a little fire down there still. That's crazy. What a mad place. That is, that is so wild. 
This is what happens when you do sports kids. Sporty driving. Results. Do good at school, so this is not how you spend your life. Yeah. Although you can afford to do this. Although so it is pretty fucking fun. So you can fun. afford to pay a race team to do this for Yeah. You. Although it is fucking fun, and if you don't do it, you're missing out. How about that? How about them apples, bro? 